Hi, I'm Dr. Nathan Wallach, and I'm going to be your professor for Intro to Computing this uh, semester, uh, where we're going to be looking at the processing programming language. Uh, a couple things just about me to get started to uh, introduce myself. Um, one, I'm not a computer scientist. I actually started out in music, um, uh, doing a lot of stuff, uh, playing for traditional instruments, uh, but got into computer music as, uh, as a way of uh, extending what I was doing with music, and, and that's really where my journey into coding and programming began. Um, and maybe that's something that will is encouraging for you because maybe you don't think of yourself as someone who could be a programmer, could be a coder, um, and uh, that, that might encourage you to, to kind of uh, think of yourself in that way and think about how you might, in whatever it is you do, apply programming concepts uh, to what it is you do and how that might uh, in, in help expand what's possible with whatever your interests and your passions are. Basically, my interest in programming goes to the fact that uh, my own research, I'm a programmer on the Jamoma project. Uh, it's an interactive music and art platform that uh, allows uh, the creative types to make uh, interactive applications, primarily for music, but also for an, a number of other um, creative applications in, involving graphics and media and those sorts of things. Um, it's an international team of, of artists and programmers. Uh, we work virtually. We uh, collaborate online through a lot of things. Um, and we also get to travel and, and meet, basically. Um, so we get to have meetings at various locations around the world when we, get, when we gather and work on the project. Uh, it's also a reason why I, I spent six months in Norway working with one of the programmers there, basically. So a little tidbit about me is that being there on a, on a Fulbright was a really transformative experience back in 2012. Um, but you know, so you'll hear me talk about um, Norway probably at some point this semester and talking and working through this course. Um, in terms of my personal life, uh, I'm married. I have two daughters. Uh, I'm uh, who are 10 and 6, and I've actually started teaching them some creative programming uh, lessons as well. So it, it, you got to start them out early and, and uh, get them working with uh, computers and not afraid to uh, actually program these things, not just use software. Uh, I'm a native of Florida, and I'm also a Stetson alum. So I've, I've been in your shoes taking classes here at Stetson, and I've, I've been around uh, Florida a long time, but also been around, uh, been able to travel as well, as I've, I've mentioned already. Um, I bike to work. Uh, that's something that impacts a lot of uh, what I do. Um, so if you hear me talking about the weather, it's not just me being polite. It's uh, actually that it impacts my daily uh, travel back and forth to campus. Uh, the fact that we have these afternoon rain showers this time of year and uh, throughout the year, basically. So in terms of my interest in the course, uh, I'm really uh, coming from this, at this prerogative of uh, creative coding, the idea that uh, Programming computers can be a platform for doing creative things and, and uh, exploring creative applications. Um, this is something that's gained a lot of interest here in the last five to ten years. Uh, the tools are more widely available than they used to be for doing this sort of thing. Uh, a lot of tools are free, as the processing programming language is. Um, and that's really going to be the prerogative of this course, is that we're going to be using programming as a tool for creative applications and, and doing creative things, um, such as creating a small games, creating uh, interactive graphics, um, and uh, just exploring that. Um, but it's really a good place to start for learning uh, uh, programming concepts. Um, and so that's really going to be uh, what we're focusing on this semester. And we'll learn a lot along the way, and but hopefully have a lot of fun along the way as we do creative things with our computers. So that's it for my quick intro, and I look forward to working with you this semester.